Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about how to enable two new hidden features that you can find inside the build 23516, the latest build from the dev channel. One of the new features is available for a few builds now, but I wanted to show that also in this video because it is a pretty interesting new feature. So as always in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable those features and how they are working. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this. One. So let's begin with the video. First of all, as always, we're going to have to set up Vive Tool. So you can just get Vive Tool from the article below in the video's description. Just make sure to get the latest version. .zip. You can just open it up using File Explorer, click on Extract All, click on Browse, and make sure you extract it into the System32 location in this PC, Local Disk C, Windows, and then scroll down to Locate System32, select Folder, Extract. In my case, I'm going to have to replace the files, click on Continue, and Vive Tool is set up on my computer. And that's how we're going to be able to enable these two new hidden features. After we've done that, we have to open up the CMD from the search box, type in there CMD, and then click on Run as Administrator, and on user account control, of course, click on Yes. First of all, we're going to enable the new desktop switching animation and labels that are shown when you switch between desktops using the task view function. So we need to enable two commands for that. First command will be this one, vivetool slash enable slash ID 34508225. Press Enter, and you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. This is the command or the ID that will enable the new labels, and now second command for this feature is vive tool slash enable slash ad 42354458 press enter and again you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration and the second hidden feature from this video can be enabled using this command vive tool slash enable slash ad 39847173 press enter and this will enable the new fix your problems using windows update section inside the settings app and i think that is pretty nice a huge shout out to phantom ocean 3 for discovering these ids and these hidden features you can follow him on twitter if you want to learn more about hidden features like these ones. So after you run all these commands, you can exit out from the CMD and make sure you restart your computer for the changes to take effect. Now, after the restart, let's check out the new features that we've enabled. First of all, let's see the new labels and animations when switching desktops. And basically, we're going to have to right click on the taskbar, click on taskbar settings and enable task view, of course. Click on task view. And here, as you can see, I already have two desktops created, but I'm going to create a new desktop. And as you can see, you can change their name. So I'm going to put here Windows Live dev and we have tech based so I'm gonna go to tech based as you can see we have the label and if I use control Windows plus right or left arrows I can switch between desktops as you can see there is a new animation and the labels that show you basically what desktop you are currently on and I think that is pretty nice and the animation is pretty smooth in my opinion and you can do this of course with multiple desktops so let's create a new one for example Windows 11 23 h2 let's go to tech based again and use the same keyboard combination Windows 11 dev Windows 1123H2 and this is how easily you can use this. And I think the new animation and new labels are looking pretty nice and are pretty useful. Now for the second and last feature from this video, you can open up the settings app and then go into system and then scroll down a bit to recovery and you'll notice here, fix problems using Windows Update. We install your current version of Windows, your apps, files and settings will be preserved. You can click on reinstall now and if you click on that, you'll notice this new section that basically says that you can fix system component corruption by reinstalling the current version of Windows and all your apps, documents, and settings will be preserved. You also have to make sure that your PC is on and connected to the network and a power source. And after installation, Windows will let you know when it's time to restart to complete the repair, or you can check to automatically restart the PC 15 minutes after installation and click on OK. And basically the whole process will be done through Windows Update. And I think that is a really nice new addition inside the dev channel of Windows 11. And hopefully we will see this soon enough on the main release as well. So this was the video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to set a Vive tool and also get all the commands from the article below in the video's description if you want to enable these hidden features on the latest build from the dev channel. Don't forget to also leave a like below and subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.